In this video, you will learn how to fix Android Auto not working. Many people have issues with this app. It can be frustrating when your phone won't connect to your car. But don't worry, I will go through some easy steps to help you get it working again. First things first, let's check your device settings. Start by swiping down from the top of your screen to access the notification panel. Tap on the gear icon located at the top right corner to open the settings page. Once you're in settings, look for connected devices. Tap on it to proceed. Now, scroll all the way down until you find Android Auto. Tap on it to access its specific settings. Here, make sure everything is configured correctly. Focus particularly on this option, start Android Auto automatically. If this is set to if used on last drive, change it to either always or select default set by the car. This ensures that Android Auto launches every time you connect your phone. After adjusting those settings, return to the main settings page. Now scroll down and find Apps. Tap on it. In this section, you need to locate the Android Auto app. You can either scroll through the list or use the search button at the top right corner for quicker access. Once you've found it, tap on it. You'll be taken to the app info page. First up, tap on Force Stop. Next, let's check permissions by tapping on Permissions. Ensure that all necessary permissions are granted. Without these permissions, Android Auto may not function properly. After confirming permissions, go back. Scroll down slightly until you see Storage. Here, first tap on Clear Cache. Then tap Clear Data as well. Now that you've cleared both cache and storage, it's time to restart your device. A fresh reboot can often resolve lingering problems effectively. If after following these steps Android Auto is still not working properly, consider updating your device software. Make sure you're running the latest version available. Updates often contain crucial fixes that improve compatibility with apps like Android Auto. And there you have it. By following these steps, adjusting settings, managing app permissions, clearing cache and storage, you should be able to fix most issues related to Android Auto not working. So that wraps up this tutorial. If you have any questions about this whole process, please let me know in the comments section below. And if this video helped you out, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more tutorial videos like this one. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day.